Amatocycline is another novel tetracycline that is being developed. This one is pursuing indications for complicated skin infections and for community acquired pneumonia. Now, as a novel tetracycline here, I kind of see it as a potential fluoroquinolone replacement in the treatment of uh, community acquired pneumonia and some other mixed infections, such as the skin and soft tissue infections that, that have been developed. So with some of the warnings that have come out discouraging fluoroquinolone use for certain indications, uh, warnings from FDA that are fairly strong, there are limited other options. Now many of those other options, when they work, are cheap, inexpensive generic antibiotics that should, should be used. But for the more resistant infections where sometimes something else is needed, omatocycline could potentially be a agent that we use and it should be available orally, which would be a significant plus compared to most of the other drugs that have been developed in the past five to six years.